Harry and Meghan disappointed after Emmy snubbed the recent Emmy nominations have left Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, feeling disappointed. Their Netflix series did not receive any nominations, which has left Meghan Markle understandably frustrated. The snub has raised questions about the couple's motives in joining the A-list crowd and their acceptance within Hollywood. Despite claims of invitations to prestigious events like the Met Gala and the Oscars, it seems that Hollywood is not as welcoming to the Sussexes as they had hoped. While their series may have garnered high ratings, success does not always translate into awards. There have been rumors circulating that Meghan has bought awards for herself in the past, but such allegations should be taken with caution. It's more likely that Meghan would hold Harry and their production team responsible for the Emmy snub, as they were promised a nomination. It's worth noting that Meghan's agent, Ari Emanuel, and their agency, WME, hold significant influence in Hollywood. However, even with their involvement, the couple's lack of nomination is seen as a clear indication of the disdain they face in the industry. The Sussexes' rebranding efforts have been met with skepticism, and their absence from major events and parties speaks volumes. Interestingly, Oprah's documentary series, The Me You Cannot See, received a nomination for the Michelle Obama episode but not the one featuring Prince Harry. This has raised speculation about WME's hesitancy to associate themselves with that particular project due to its controversial nature and alleged promotion of falsehoods. WME's involvement with Meghan, including the development of their production company, Archwell, has faced criticism in recent weeks. The Emmy snub only adds to the challenges the couple is facing. It reflects a broader sense of disappointment and suggests that their current trajectory is not working as intended. Without an Emmy nomination, Harry and Meghan might miss out on lucrative exclusive deals and contracts, potentially costing them over $300 million, according to media commentator Mark Boardman. While some royal fans argue that the couple didn't deserve a nomination, others mock the alleged snub. They question why the Emmys would consider honoring a documentary filled with lies and fabricated stories. Overall, the Emmy snub serves as a blow to Harry and Meghan's aspirations and highlights the obstacles they are currently facing. It remains to be seen how they will navigate these challenges and regain their footing in the industry.